Trust and truth aren't the same thing, but somehow they're connected. Where there is truth, there is trust. I'm sure we would all agree we hate to be let down. We don't like it when someone says they will do something and then end up not doing it. God is different. Let me share with you this wonderful verse today. Psalm 31 verse 5 says, Into your hand I commit my spirit. You have redeemed me, O Lord, faithful God. Now watch how the psalmist just made a prayer of commitment to the Lord. And not just to anyone. He committed himself to none other than the faithful God of truth. El Emet, God is truth. He is the God of truth. He is not a man that he should lie. Whatever he said, he will do. Whatever he has spoken, he will make it good. Has someone or something ever failed you? Has someone ever broken your trust? Perhaps you find it hard to believe again. But let me say this again, God is different. Can you say that with me? God is different. He is truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. He will always keep his promise. When God says, do not be afraid because he is with you, know that he is really with you. He takes you by the hand. When he says, you can find peace in him because he has overcome the world, you can find peace in him. He has won it all for you. When God says he knows his plans for you, even when you're not sure of what lies ahead, God means it when he says he knows it. God is true. He will never put you to shame. You can always count on him. Will you commit your life into his hands today? I hope this message encouraged you today. If this message has blessed you, give it a like or share it with your friends and be an encouragement to someone today. Have a great day.